Cause I know truth love ain't easy. Ain't easy. Girl, I know it's you cause you complete me. Complete me. Girl. And I just don't want you to leave. No, I can't it, girl. Even though I give you reasons. Cause baby, sometimes I can tell just by your face this part of us been gone for so long. And I know there's no replacing what we had going on for so long. Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. It's actually one o'clock in the morning right now and I have a hair appointment at 10 a.m. and my quick weave is still in my head. So first of all, this is gonna be like my maintenance week, self-care week, girl therapy week, you know, just having my appointments, getting stuff done. Really just like a self-care week because I can't lie, I need to like get myself together for a real like maintenance wise and self-care wise, but I'm so tired and literally I have to be at my hair appointment at 10 a.m. I'm getting passion twists, by the way. I've never had passion twists before, so this is going to be our first time getting them. So we're going to try them out. But I still have my quick weave in my head, clearly. And this quick weave was so cute, I really didn't even want to take it out. Like, I really did not even want to take it out. But let me tell y'all what the plan is. The plan is I'm going to wake up hella early in the morning take down my quick weave take out my braids that's under here and wash my hair and blow dry it out and still make it to my hair appointment at 10 a.m that's the plan so clearly i'm going to wake up hella early probably around like 7 a.m and do all that junk but that's the plan so i'm hoping that i can do everything but i really don't know because i don't feel like doing it right now i'm just letting y'all know the plans what we got going on tomorrow so yeah i'm gonna see y'all in the morning we're gonna start trying to get my hair taken down or whatever i just hope i can make it to my hair appointment and do all this junk like i really hope so like this, like, this is a lot like i'm stressed out and maintenance week should not be stressful but i'm telling y'all this junk is stressful like i don't know if i'm the only one who feel like maintenance week be stressful it be stressing me out like i would think maintenance week supposed to be like self-care relax no this shit is stressful like i'm stressed i need to go to sleep for a frills so i can get some sleep and i'm gonna see y'all in the morning on the horses before the sunset and I can see it from my window I can see this from my window window Good morning, y'all. So this morning I woke up around like seven o'clock. I took down my quick weave, took down my braids, washed my hair, bow dried my hair out this morning. We gotta make it to my hair appointment, which is in an hour. <laughs> Yeah, my appointment's in an hour, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave the house. I'm pretty sure I already told y'all like how I'm getting my hair done, but I'm going to a new stylist today that I've never been to before, so we trying out somebody new. But I wanna stop at Chick-fil-A this morning, so I'm trying to hurry up and go ahead and get in the car so we can head go get their hair done. Hopefully, I hope the hairstyle don't take like too, too long, cause I can't lie, I'm so tired. But I think she only like 20 minutes away from me, so I really should get there like still on time for real. So, yeah. Bye-bye, Ace. I'll be back. Be good, okay? He ain't gonna do nothing but sit freaking on that couch and sleep all day. That's what he do. Like, that is what he do. Where my Crocs at? Yeah, I'm putting my Crocs on. And y'all, this is what Ace be watching when I be gone. I be having him on Tubi every time I leave. Because I just be feeling like my dog don't want to sit in silence. I hope I got gas in my car. Y'all, it's 9.14 and I was finna go to Chick-fil-A. And then my tire pressure light came on and it say one of my tires got low pressure. So now I got to go put air on my tire. But I'm going to just go to this place up the street and have them do it for me. <laughs> because, I mean, I know how to put air in my tire, but I'd rather them do it just because. Y'all see that joint? Low pressure. Like, okay. Like, okay. Thank you. Ah. Okay, period. Okay, so the man just put some air in my tire. Now I'm finna go to Chick-fil-A. I don't care. I'm going to Chick-fil-A. Um, I'm finna go on the girl website, like the girl who do my hair and see how long it say um, it's gonna take for her to do these twists. Cause she doing my hair for free, so let me see. Okay, she got different sizes on here. I had just seen small. I saw eight hours. We're gonna do medium. Okay, medium says four hours. Okay, okay, cool. I can do that. Hey, thank 
chicken. Okay, I just got my Chick Fil A. Um, I got a ten count chicken mini. Did they give me a straw? Okay. <laughs> I'm finna freak out. Usually, I don't never get no ten count, but I just thought about the fact that I'm really finna be here getting my hair done for a while, and I don't have like no food, no snacks. I haven't ate nothing. So it's time to get there, like at 9:56. So I'm right on time. I'm right on time. Even with my trials and tribulations. <laughs> and she just finished with my hair and I can't lie she did my hair so freaking cute like I told y'all this is my first time getting these twists before but they're so freaking cute like it just gives vacation like I don't even got no vacation plan but I feel like I need to plan one now cuz my hair just give vacation like it's so freaking cute this is my first time going to her and she ate if I didn't already put her Instagram on screen I'll make sure I put it on the screen because she ate on my hair and it didn't even take that long like it only took like five hours which was good and she just had real good energy she was nice we was just in there watching tubi movies and stuff like that yeah she was real cool so yeah i would definitely go back to her because baby she ate y'all in atlanta y'all need y'all hair done y'all gotta go to her okay period because what i feel like it's so many cute styles i can do with these twists like i can put them up in ponytails you know put some to the back put it up in a bun i feel like i'm gonna keep these in for a long time i don't really know how long twists last like i don't know if they last as long as braids do they probably do but i'm gonna try to keep these in for a minute because they're so cute and she did them so long like she did them so long y'all know i love long braids these not braids but when i get my hair braided and stuff i like for them to be long like you know what i'm saying and she did them long as hell i didn't even have to ask her period and she did my hair for free but i still made sure to give her a tip because yeah make sure i go book with her but i'm finna head home I'm finna see how long it's finna take me to get home because i don't even know it said it's finna take me 55 minutes to get home 55 minutes like i already knew it was finna be like that it's always like that it be taking a short amount of time to get somewhere, but on the way back, baby, be crazy. Hey, y'all, so I'm back at home. It's 8 o'clock at night. Well, actually, yeah, it's 8 o'clock. It's going to be 9 o'clock. Um, earlier, y'all saw me leaving my hair appointment. It took me, like, freaking an hour and 30 minutes to get home because the traffic was so freaking bad. But, yeah, I showed y'all my hair. It came out super, super cute. It's so long and so pretty. It's got all the little curly pieces like this junk ate. But right now I'm cooking dinner for myself because I really haven't ate since I ate at Chick-fil-A this morning. And I was hungry and I wanted to cook. So I'm making loaded baked potatoes with steak and shrimp inside. So y'all just finna come cook with me because we've been cooking recently, okay? Y'all know, y'all know. We've been cooking. If you're new here, we've been cooking. I don't know what y'all been doing, but we've been cooking. And this is my first time making shrimp and loaded baked potatoes. Y'all know I done made steak before, so I'm not worried about that. But this is my first time making shrimp and loaded baked potatoes. Y'all, I'm over here cooking everything at once. I'm doing my little shrimp. I don't think it take long for shrimp to cook, so they're probably done. But it's like, I don't know if I put enough seasoning on them or not. I made my potatoes with my um steak and my shrimp, and we finna try them. Bro, y'all see this hair? Mm. Mm. Okay, period. Once again. I snapped. <laughs> Once again, 
I snap. I need to get my nails done and my toes done. These nails, they got to go. I'm not sure what day I'm gonna go get my nails and toes done. It could be tomorrow or I might just wait till like Tuesday or Monday. My lashes are already done, so I don't need to get my lashes done this week. But I got other appointments to go to and things to do this week. So I'm gonna just see y'all tomorrow. I'm gonna get ready to go to sleep after I eat my food, so. Hey y'all, so today is Sunday, it's 2.21, and I'm not doing no maintenance, nothing for real today, I'm just chilling in the house, like I don't feel like getting my nails and toes done today, or going to do that stuff I gotta do, I'm chilling. I was just on TikTok, and I seen this girl who I follow, she went to go get some mango sticky rice, and she said it was good, so I was just like, I wanna go try it. I guess it's like a dessert or something i don't know but i've been seeing it everywhere my person i am oh i would love trying new stuff and i want to go see what it tastes like like i just won't be complete until i can wrap my head around what mangoes and rice taste like mm. all right we're on the way to the sushi bar because that's where they got it at i hope this junk good i feel like it's gonna be good like i feel like it's one of them things where it's like you would never think to eat it but it's like when that one time you do it just changed your life. Like, that's how I feel on the inside. <laughs> uh, we finna be there. Cause this jump real close. Okay, hey, y'all, I'm here in the restaurant, but I'm finna take it to go and eat it in the car. Cause they feel so I got me a lemonade. I got my mango sticky rice and I was gonna eat it in there, but the people behind me, that was so loud. And it's like, I wanted to talk to y'all, but I wasn't even going to be able to talk to y'all. Y'all was not going to be able to hear me because, baby, them folks behind me was so loud. I was like, oh my gosh. They was just talking about everything. I was just like, let me take my ass on in the car and eat the junk because they finna be talking for who know how long. So I just got it to go. And now we finna try it. It's actually hot. Okay, I can smell the mango. Okay. <laughs> there definitely is some sticky rice because it's not moving. Okay, I'm gonna get a piece of mango and a piece of rice <laughs> and try it. Mm. Okay. I don't hate it at all. And then like the rice is sweet too. The rice is sweet, so I guess that helps it out. Okay, y'all, so I just got up, and I hope my settings is okay, because I just changed my settings, so hopefully this don't look right. But it's the next day from the last time that y'all saw me, and today we gonna get my nails and my toes done, but I do have to go to class at 125. So it's like 8 o'clock in the morning, or it might be 9 right now, and the nail um shop that I go to, they open up at 9 30 so i'm gonna get there as soon as they open up because i really want to go ahead and get my nails and toes done like now like at the same time i don't want to have to come back but i don't know if i have enough time because like i said i have to be at class at 125 and y'all know my school is like 30 40 minutes away depending on the traffic so I'm going to tell them, like, okay, like, when I go in there, I'm going to just tell them I want a new set, full set. And then after they do my nails, I'm going to see what time it is and see if I have time to get my pedicure done. Like, if I have time, I'm going to go ahead and do that. But if I don't, I'm just going ahead and get my pedicure either after I leave class or, like, tomorrow or something. But we getting my nails done. I already know how I want my nails. I want them short again, but I want, um... French tip, just white French tip. Like, that's just what I want. I want basic, white, clean French tip. Because French tip is that girl. Like, French tip is that girl. If you know, you know. If you don't, you don't know. But, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get up because it's 9.04. And I want to eat something before I go get my nails done. I'm so glad I don't got to do my hair. I don't got to do nothing to my hair but swoop these little edges up. And I'm going to go ahead, brush my teeth, wash my face, put on some clothes. And get ready to go. If these curly pieces in my hair started becoming like too much to handle, I'm cutting them out. I don't know if I should like put mousse on them or something. I haven't been putting nothing on the curls, but I don't want them to get like nappy, you know? So I don't know if it's something I should be putting on them or not. I really don't know. So I just got dressed. And we finna go ahead to the nail salon. I can't lie, it's like 10 o'clock right now. I let the time 
get away from me. So we gotta hurry up. I already know I'm not gonna have time to get my nails and toes done both right now. So we're just gonna focus on my nails and we'll do the toes probably after class or something like that. But we finna go. I got on an all black outfit and I got on my sunglasses today. Cause I never really wear these for real, for real. But they go on my outfit and it's sunny outside. So yeah. Bruh, now I gotta find an address. It's like, I know where it's at, but I be forgetting how to get to the actual parking garage that I park in. I hope I got it saved in my phone somewhere. Oh my God. No. Bro, I'm gonna have to find it now. It's gonna take me forever. Let me find this jump. S L I M E. I kiss it and get at it. I make love and they just hit because you're rich. It's money I'm getting. They got me all day and all. I can live life on a boat like not a cup. My pot ain't no, not a doubt on my mind. No, I'm doing it for the signs, baby. Oh, snap. Oh my god, my freaking camera. I just got to Buckhead Village because this is where I get my nails done at. Um, I feel like I'm trying, I be trying to park in the same spot I always park at so that I don't be confused on like where to go. But we here finally! And I didn't even get to eat no food or nothing. Hopefully, this don't take too long because. But I am getting a full set and I need them to take off all these nails. Like, I don't want no filling or nothing. We're going full set. So, but I'm gonna have them take them off the quick way because I'm not doing no soak off because that junk takes forever. They can just go in and clip these toes off. It's 10 o'clock right now. I got here like right at 10 o'clock. And I'm gonna just come back and get my toes done whenever I feel like coming back. I don't know. Maybe after class, depending on how I'm feeling. Really, with my toes, I can go anywhere to get my toes done. Like, honestly. Like, I could go to any nail salon. I'm not really picky about that. I'm really just picky about my nails. And hopefully the man in here who do nails real good, hopefully he in here and he can do my nails today. Because them other folks, they don't be giving a fuck. Like they just be doing them however the hell they want to. Like he be taking time, like he know how to do nails real good. But he don't be in here every time I go, so I don't know. Y'all, it's such a pretty ass day outside. So, y'all, I just got done with my nails. I got short French tips, and she did them so freaking cute. Like, this was exactly how I wanted them. And now my nails look so cute but while i was in there like close to me being done it was all these folks up in there and the lady told me that they was filming a movie they had all these cameras it was so much going on i was just ready to get the hell up out of there because it was just too much i don't know if it was like a tubi movie or what what time is it it's 11 35 okay oh i'm on good time i really could have got my toes done now that i think about it but I didn't know if they was gonna let me cause they was filming that movie like by the time I got done. I didn't even know if I was supposed to be up in there. Like when I tell y'all, I was the only person in the nail salon getting my nails done. Like I was the only person in there like the whole time. And then once she started painting my French tips white, that's when they started coming in there to get ready to film whatever scene they was doing, I don't know. So that's why I did have enough time to get my toes done but I was like, Maybe they not gonna let me cause they trying to film this movie. But it's like where they was filming it at, it was like where you do the pedicure. So I was like, I ain't even finna ask. I'm just gonna go get my toes done probably after I get out of class. Then I'm finna go to right now. But oh, I just feel so together. I just feel so together. Like my hair is done, now my nails are done. Yeah, I can't say nothing about my nails cause they looking good now gonna get my toes done i might get you know this and that like i just feel so good like oh, oh i love maintenance week love, love maintenance week down but 
<sighs> Let me see. I'm finna go get me some food first. I could stop by my house because I do have food there. I can eat. But only thing about that is um I don't really feel like going all the way in my apartment and then which I'm gonna call it leaving all the way out. Like I just feel like that's doing too much. So I'm just finna go get some real quick and then head to class. It says it's only gonna take me 32 minutes to get to school. So I'm trying to figure out what I wanna eat. Like, do I wanna get food food or do I want to just like get something quick? Cause I really do got time. I can go sit down and get some if I want some. But I was trying to think what. I kind of want some sushi, but I don't really want to pay $20 for no sushi right now. I just wanted something. Who calling me? Bro, it be these random ass numbers calling me. Hello? And they don't say nothing. Like, why is y'all wasting my time calling me? Like, don't call me. Like, literally, it be random ass numbers calling me for no reason because they don't be saying nothing. Like, they don't be having nothing to say. I got faith in my husband, we chase. I know I'm her sweetheart, but I know she's a just poor. I got my class on. So, my main mom and the cat is getting on. This bitch sounds like he's so worth his time. Switch your time. Hey y'all, so today is actually the next day. Yesterday, I didn't even go get my toes done after class. I literally came home and went straight to sleep. Like, I took a nap. So, I'm gonna go today because I need to go ahead and get my toes done. I ain't had my toes done in a minute. Oh, <laughs> I just took my sock off to look at my feet. Yeah, baby, I need my toes done bad. So, we're gonna go today. But I just, like, got ready, put some clothes on. Before I go get my toes done, I'm gonna stop at Sephora. Because they finally got stuff that I need in the store. Like, usually when I go there, it be stuff I be wanting to get, but they don't be having it in there. But I just looked online, and they actually do got some of the stuff that I need. Like, some of the stuff that I've been wanting to get for a minute. They finally got it in stock in the store. So, we finna go there first before I go get my um toes done. I have my hair and like a little ponytail to the side. It's cute. But I'm finna get my bag and get my shoes and go because I need to be back at home by 5 o'clock. Let me tell y'all what I need to get from Sephora. So first of all, I want them lip glosses that I've just been seeing everywhere. The Topicals one and Summer Fridays because I don't have either one of those. But I want them because I want to up my lip gloss collection anyway. And everybody be talking about those like they is the best thing ever. So... I'm finna, you know what I'm saying, find out for real. So I want one of those, one of each of those. And I want the topical faded cream. Cause I've been trying to get rid of like hyperpigmentation. Even though I can't lie, my hyperpigmentation has like lightened up or like cleared up so much within like the past couple months. I don't really know like what specific product is from that I've been using or if it's just from me. I don't know, but that junk has cleared up so freaking much, but I want to get it gone. Like, I want to get out of here. So, I want to try their faded cream because I heard it was good. And what else did I want to go in there for? Oh, and they eye patches. And current time is 1.49. And I told y'all I needed to be back home at, um, well, by 5 o'clock. It's like the only reason I got to be back home is because I got to do my online class. Like my Zoom class, I got to do that at 5 but i really can log on today anywhere from my phone i just i don't know i've been drinking my water bottle this morning drinking my water Okay, y'all, so I'm at Atlantic Station. I'm finna park and then we're gonna go to Sephora. It's 207. I wonder do I got time to go get me some food. I really was gonna cook tonight, so I really kinda don't even need to go get no food. Cause I really just need to cook today, but I'm hungry. I haven't eaten nothing yet, so I might go get me some food. Mm, 
okay y'all see they gave me a ticket today because when me and Lex had came here um I don't even remember when that junk was but when we had came here like um last week or something oh after that football game and we had came here that junk was not working like it did not give us no ticket so we just came through because the little thing that closed like the little gate thing um that junk it was just up and we kept on pressing the button like ticket and that junk did not spit out a ticket so what the fuck what was we gonna do like what was we gonna do just sit there while there's cars behind us trying to get in like and it's not like you can back up you know what i'm saying so like what was we gonna do so we just came up through there and then and then when it was time to leave we was thinking like damn how's we gonna get out because we never got a ticket you know what i'm saying the only way you can get out is if you got a ticket and we didn't have one so we were stuck like we couldn't get out because when you get to the gate they gotta read the thing gotta read your license plate you know what i'm saying but it never read our license plate because we never got a ticket in the first place because the thing wasn't working so we was like oh my god so we had to go talk to this lady in this um office and tell her like the thing was broke and it never gave us a ticket and she was just like oh well y'all gotta pay it lost ticket fee and we was like what like why do we gotta pay a lost ticket fee when we never got a ticket in the first place like that don't make sense like how's we gonna pay for losing a ticket when we never got the ticket like you get what i'm saying so it's like that whole thing just did not make no sense so we we're just going back and forth for the lady for like i don't even know how long and then after that we was just like fuck it we just gonna go like you know what i'm saying like we just finna go so we had just um followed behind somebody else <laughs> and i can't lie that little gate thing that don't be closing fast like i didn't even think we was gonna make it like that little gate be closing fast like how the apartment gates be that joint closed so fast i really didn't even think we were gonna make it but we made it up out of there but yeah that joint did piss me off because it's like how is y'all gonna charge us for losing the ticket when y'all machine wasn't working and there was no way for us to get a ticket like it's not like we could go to another you know little thing and get a ticket we were stuck like we couldn't you know what i'm saying Anyways, it's 2 10. We here. I'm gonna go ahead and walk to Sephora and I'm gonna try to record in there. I'm gonna take my um camera off the tripod because it's easier for me to record when my camera isn't on the tripod, like when I'm like out and walking. I feel like the tripod it be just be too much. Like it just make it so noticeable. When I just hold my camera like this, just straight camera, I can record easier. So we can we're finna go. I want to do they got a nail slot over here. At Atlantic Station because I feel like they do like I feel like I don't see a nail salon over here I hope they do because I can just go to that one yeah they do they have a lush nail bar over here okay that's what I thought I was like I swear I don't pass by a nail salon over here so I'm gonna just go to the nail salon in Atlantic Station while I'm over here I'm gonna go to Sephora first though and then we're gonna go yeah I might as well eat here too shit <sighs> I kind of want to go into Pandora too because I want to get me a new charm for my bracelet I'm in Sephora and this is literally everything I need is right here so I'm gonna get one of these faded um dark spot thing the brightness serum I'm gonna get one of these two. Oh, they got the eye patches oh these are the eye masks okay I'm gonna get one of these two I think there's so much money in here I love Sephora I like camera oh okay. yeah I got the three things from Topicals. So, what else would I come in here for? I had also came in here. Let me get one of these little things. Okay, they got the Summer Fridays right here. It's a lot of them. I don't know which one to get. Like, it's so many of them. I don't know which one I should get. Let me see. This one is vanilla. That sounds like it. Let me see what they smell like. I feel like I would like the vanilla one more than anything. Mmm, that smells good. Okay, that's the vanilla. And then they got a brown sugar vanilla beige. I'm gonna just get the vanilla one. And I feel like that's all I came in here for, but I'm gonna look at the makeup stuff too while I'm in here. 
everybody said that this is such a good primer but i don't know maybe i should get like a small one even a small one 20 dollars but i'd be saying everybody uses primer and they be like it's so good y'all i'm checking out and after this i'm gonna go to lush nail bar i'm doing good on time it's only 225 can't wait to try my new lip gloss they said the um, nail salon is only a four minute walk. But I'm so hungry. You gotta give me some food before I fall out on the flow. Yeah, that's true. Well, I just like do like vlogs. Like, I'm in college, so I be vlogging like my college life, just regular life. Me so, can I vlog studying for the LSAT? Yeah. You really have any thousand? Yeah, I've been doing it for like two years. How often do I have to make content? Mm, for like what, YouTube? I would say like post once a week. Like start out with posting one video a week. I do one every day and I only have 200 followers. Are they long? Mm, I would say just do once a week. It's like you gotta worry about your thumbnail, your title. Really? Yeah, like it's a lot. Um, could I interview you? Probably have like 800,000. I just made like my very first ever Instagram page like two years ago. Like I've never had Instagram before. And you really just gotta appeal to your audience. Like you gotta know. I don't know who my audience is. Yeah. But I noticed that when I put in the title. Um, I just left Sephora. I'm trying to figure out where the way I'm literally not even walking in the right direction is crazy. But I just left Sephora and the lady who checked me out, she was so nice. She was just asking me a whole bunch of questions about content and stuff like that. She was so surprised to see that I had like 80,000 on YouTube. She was so shocked. And so I really was just telling her everything. Cause she would ask me so many questions. She's like, oh my God. <laughs> I was just telling her everything. Cause she said she wanna, um, you know, start getting into it. But she said she been doing it. She said she just hasn't really seen like, you know, the growth for her that she wanna see. So I was just giving her advice, you know, I should have asked her to pull up her YouTube so I could look at it, but she followed me, but she DM'd me on Instagram, so I'm gonna go look at it. You know, this is a cute place. I ain't never seen this before. What is this? Okay. That's so cute. It's like a little restaurant, but I'm here at Lush, so we finna go get my toes done. I'm getting my toes done so my toes is done but I can't lie I'm never going back to that nail salon again like they did a good job but they pricey as hell I almost spent the same amount of money that I spent on my nails on my toes so y'all I'm in the car but before I leave I want to go ahead and try my lip glosses like I don't care I don't want to wait I want to try them out now I'm excited mm. I don't even got no neck I'm sure you're gonna like this though Okay, took off my aqua four those on my mouth. I'm gonna try the topicals first. Okay, period. Let me put it on. It's mint. Oh, oh. <laughs> Hold on, I like this. Oh, I really do like this. I like this, and it feel like real, real smooth. Like, it feel moisturizing. Like, it feel like my lips gonna be moisturized all day. I saw they was debating about if it was like sticky and stuff. This joint is not sticky. This joint is creamy, moisturizing, good. Like, hello. Mmm, I like this. Okay, new lip gloss. 
it feels so good it's not sticky at all to be honest like it don't even feel sticky like it's not thick or nothing okay good purchase this was a good purchase so now let's try the summer fridays i had got the vanilla one Mm -hmm. Okay, this one feel different than the topicals, I can't lie. Okay, this is nice. This is cute. Um this one feel more like a lip balm for real, for real. like this one don't feel like a lip gloss as much this one really just feel like a lip balm like it don't feel as glossy as the topicals do but okay i like it so i'm just gonna keep this on since i already got it on but i kind of feel like i like the topicals one more but i'm really not gonna know until i start wearing them for real, for real. But yes, no lip glosses. So I'm gonna go get me some food. I don't know from where, but I'm gonna figure it out because I am starving. I really need to figure out what I'm gonna cook tonight so that I can go ahead and go to the stove while I'm out and get my ingredients, like whatever I need. I need to go ahead and figure that out. That's what I need to do. So my original plan was to like, oh. But my original plan was to cook, but I don't feel like cooking no more, to be honest. I don't even feel like cooking no more. So I'm just finna go get me some wings. Yeah, that's what I'm finna get, because I don't even feel like... I might get some rice, too, some hibachi rice, but I don't know if they rice is good or not. But yeah, I don't even feel like cooking. I came all the way to Kroger just to sit in the parking lot and not even go inside. But it's getting closer and closer to the time that I need to um, be back at home. It's 418, so. And I told you I need to be back there at 5, so. Yeah, time to get going. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and get my wings. Luckily, the place that I be getting my wings from. What you doing, man? What is you doing? You gonna turn? Make your turn. I'm finna. Okay. I don't know what the fuck got going on. It be all these geese over here, which I've never seen geese over here since I moved here until now. So I don't know if it's like a lake or a pond or something somewhere over here. It gotta be because why else would there be geese? But I need to give them some bread one day. Like one day I'm driving over here, I need to get a geese some bread. Because I used to love doing that when I was younger. And they be looking like you know they hungry or something so one day i'm gonna come by here with some bread and get them some bread <laughs> so i am back at home with my wings literally right in time because it's 444 oh it's 444 oh shit okay well it's 445 now but literally when i had said that it was 444 well i'm gonna find me another documentary to watch because oh my gosh let me tell y'all what y'all need to watch if y'all haven't watched it already, go on Netflix and watch what Jennifer did. It was so freaking good. Like, it was so good. Y'all have got to go watch that. I'm not even going to tell y'all what it's about. Just go watch it. Like, it's so good. You're not going to regret it. It was real good. I love stuff like that. So, I'm going to try to find me, like, a documentary or something like that to watch while I eat my food. Oh, 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 oh! We got honey hot lemon pepper. Oh, this joint looks so good. Like, what? Okay, y'all, so it's 8 o'clock at night right now. I just took a shower, and I'm about to... What am I finna do? Oh, um, I'm finna use the eye patches and this serum stuff that I bought. I'm gonna use it for the first time tonight while I'm getting ready to get in the bed or whatever. I've been fiending to use these eye patches. Like, y'all don't even know. Mm. All right, so it come with six eye patches. They are so freaking cute. <laughs> ah, I'm a topical girly. What y'all got to say now? I got my eye patches on, so let me see what time it is. 
it's 8 41 so i'm 15 minutes i'm gonna go ahead take them off do my skincare routine use the faded cream and get ready for bed um i don't really know what i'm doing tomorrow well i do know what one of the things i'm doing tomorrow but it's not a part of this video y'all gotta wait for the next video to see what that's about hey y'all so this is probably gonna be where i end this video i couldn't really vlog nothing today for this maintenance vlog because maintenance is pretty much over and like all the stuff i was doing today is for my next video so yeah i gotta stay tuned for that okay couldn't include it in here but if y'all follow me on tiktok then you already know what i've been up to like that's really how you got to keep up with me because tiktok they know about stuff like this before it get to youtube but youtube videos always be better because it like be more in depth like i tell y'all more tiktok just be a quick rundown if you know you know but yeah this is how i'm going in my maintenance vlog so hope y'all enjoyed it um if you're new here make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're not new um i love you <laughs> i love y'all um make sure y'all like the video make sure y'all comment talk to me in the comments and i love you guys and i'm gonna see y'all in my next video and bye Mwah.